Ginger ale Hi! nuts. Hi and hello. We're D2E and you're you, and this is Kingdom Hearts 2. Welcome yeah, back, again. everyone. Uh, we're still Plus, doing this again. Welcome back, my friends, to the show that never ends. <laughs> Right. <laughs> step inside. Step inside. Okay. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So here we are uh, with Mike. Uh, yeah, Mike. Hello. Thank you for joining it's us here again. Oh. Mike, Frog Rock Wizard, knows diddly shit about Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> that is totally fine. I Mike, what do you know about games? the Little Mermaid? That there wasn't a half naked merboy in it. I don't think. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Better in the same outfit, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> I did not expect a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, relatively speaking, I mean, I. Oh, we're doing this now. I entirely forget how to play this. Have not made a video game based on the Little Mermaid and what the hell? Donald's a squid? <laughs> yeah. Wait, aren't ducks already aquatic, though? It seems like a no, bit of a double I don't think that makes them They're amphibious. not oceanic. Okay. Is, that, is that the way you should say that? I was just saying there's some weird biological mutation going on with this shit. <laughs> you don't even know him. Neither do you. <laughs> Nobody knows him. But they can't all be as bad as you say. He and kissed I... me on a boat once. Well, I'm gonna prove it to you. They don't want to tell your dad. So that. help me, Ariel. I am going to get through to you. And if this is the only way, so weird. Oh, there were more ways. <laughs> what a dick! Holy <laughs> shit, that's murder. Little Mermaid gets dark, my friend. Yeah. Uh, was this how the original movie was? Been ages since I see it. I don't even more or less. Yeah, he yeah. does. He does smash up that statue, yeah. and uh, Ariel storms off and gets mad. And that's I mean, first the... he gets mad at her, and he's like, "Sing the song, you bitch." <laughs> well, and then does he like restore the pieces while they're like segmented? So he's like just super goddamn dead. Hang on one second, Dustin. Roll yeah. the clip! <laughs> uh, are we gonna get sued for that? No, not that clip. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> this clip! Um, so I'm gonna bang out a bunch of these in between you struggling at Kingdom Hearts. Sing the song, you bitch. Fucking. The way. The delivery on that! You should start the little mermaid for like a half second. <laughs> no, not that clip. This <laughs> one. Oh, I'm laughing at your own edits. Before you haven't happened. done them. <laughs> and won't do them for like two weeks, three weeks from now. Probably. Woo! I'm here to make all your dreams come true. <laughs> what about 15 cents? I'm here to make 15 cents come true. <laughs> Don't fall for it, darkened sky! Oh my god. No, no, she's Princess Jasmine. I know. <laughs> that's, what, that's what you... Uh, what, what? <laughs> like, you're like, oh no, wait, 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 wait. What in the rainbow's name? <laughs> I still want to do, like, a long-form video. I, I We got a couple ideas. We're, we'll probably do it this summer. Don't, like, stop her. <laughs> Don't stop me now was a song by Queen. Oh my god, man. What? <laughs> that's, that's fine. I mean, you've seen The Little Mermaid before. It's been ages since I've seen a classic Disney film. I don't remember much from that one. I don't remember much from Beauty and the Beast. I remember enough from Lion King, at least. So okay. I'll be more in depth if... Yeah. Once we get done, you can uh, make some comparison to, to Lion King, which is my uh, favorite of the two Disney movies set in Africa that loosely base themselves off the plot of Hamlet. So... The other one was Pocahontas? I was going to say the other one was Black Panther. It's set in Africa. Yeah. So you're not a fan of the Marvel Perfect. Cinematic Universe? No, no, no! no. <laughs> it's, it's, I'm jumping off it, the it's slippery. It's the favorite second, of two. Second favorite. They're both fantastic movies. It's just The Lion King is slightly more fantastic of a movie. It was the first Disney movie I ever saw, and it made such an impact on me. I love it. It's one of I two movies most, yeah. that made Andrew cry. Oh, what's, what's the other one? Robocop? Sadly, it was the remake of Les Mis. <laughs> Anne Hathaway, you whore! <laughs> you made me cry! <laughs> I don't feel comfortable now. <laughs> That's really sad. This song got to me. Uh, <laughs> Dude, up. The person I was watching it with was like, are you crying? I was like, 
Yes. yes I okay, but you didn't cry with Inside Out. I did not. No. Oh my God! You heartless. I. Uh, you're as heartless as the heartless. Yeah, Ding Dong didn't affect me that much. Wait. Mm. Well, fine. This looks so like the fish is gonna catch herself a man. Fucking emotions. <laughs> The cry and then, like the remake of Late Biz. It had a lot of close ups. It got me. Doesn't help me out here. I a lot of close ups is a weird reference. Uh, <laughs> his sister uh, D2B. Yeah. Um, was trying to talk to me about the movie before I seen it, and I just kept saying a lot of close ups, and then she would keep talking about it, and I'd be like, yeah, 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 I agree. But it did have a lot of close-ups, and <laughs> I was like, yeah, and then realized I had not seen the movie. I was just BSing her by saying a lot of close-ups. Quick, Sora, use your keyblade. Okay. Okay. And I'm... Mermaid kick! Like Mermaid kick! <laughs> <laughs> Roll the clip! <laughs> <laughs> That's the sound it should make. <laughs> that looked like a Mortal Kombat. <laughs> it did! <laughs> Ursula Shang Tsung, holy shit! She keeps the voice in the shell. Yeah, she keeps it in that and, like, can... Oh. Oh, shit. Okay, that's actually pretty important. Oh, no! Oh. She can't breathe like that! We weren't thinking hot. Okay. I mean, she is... drowning. <laughs> if that's your thing, then that's your thing! <laughs> it's I not just... my thing as much as Santa. <laughs> so got a, from the last video. Got a girl <laughs> drowning in a Santa suit that's, Where like, the ultimate... Scooby-Doo character? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Well, Velma is pretty hot, so... I, I, was, I didn't get to her yet, in yeah. my ranking. It was, it was Scrappy Doo. <laughs> Scrappy Doo was one of the hottest people I've ever seen, and I told that story on a Blossom Tales episode. Yeah. Go back far back and watch that, because that, that was a fun episode to do. Uh, Hell of a lot shorter than this nonsense. I, I, I'll explain it to you later, Mike, but there is a reason. And... Whoa. Jeez, Scrappy Doo is hot. Is what you said. But yes. You don't have the context for it yet. Oh. Ah. Well, any context where Scrappy Doo is a positive just seems wrong on the base. So. <laughs> <laughs> he, he is a horrible little monster. Oh, yes. I thought you were talking about me. <laughs> Are we? I don't know. I don't know. This <laughs> is a mystery. You'll never know for sure. Where are you reaching there, Eric? Are you looking in your pocket? <laughs> Where were you keeping that before? <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I called it out last time, but like all I hear is ninety Spider Man. Yeah. Wait a minute, wasn't this guy a blown up statue a minute ago? <laughs> no. <laughs> he didn't become the statue, it was a statue of him. <laughs> oh, I thought he was transformed into a Oh <laughs> No Man, you really thought King oh. Trike was an ass. <laughs> yeah, that's it's that's exactly. why you had that reaction. <laughs> exactly. Dustin, roll the clip! <laughs> There were more ways. <laughs> what a dick! Holy <laughs> shit, that's murder! Little Mermaid gets dark, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was like some Mortal Kombat <laughs> 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 Weren't you a statue? <laughs> I, I... Uh, isn't my face red? Don't stop the only person who can stop him. Or her. <laughs> that's what we're gonna do. Yep. Hmm. Cool. That happened. So. There was no musical number for this one. It was just a story chapter. Wow. So yeah. We have to leave and come back? I don't know if we have to leave and come back. I think we can still do oh, stuff. Go ahead and I'm sorry. Keep this man still creeps me out somehow. <laughs> yeah. Trust him. So let me um, talk to Flounder. I wonder what we can do to help. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. then I'll talk mm -hmm. to Sebastian. Mm -hmm. Go check on Ar Ariel. Let's, Let's go! And the game makes no indication that you should oh. be talking to him. We got our nice outfit. Oh, that's very nice. Split here and watch. That was my plan. This RPG speak. Very good. Are we doing this bit again? I was thinking about Golden Sun. Uh, I, I love the little blips and beeps in uh, Golden Sun. That's fair. All right. So, he's going to keep an eye on Ariel. We're going to kick Ursula's ass, I assume. Voice acting? No. <laughs> 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 Sorry, with <went> Star Fox. <laughs> <laughs> so they're just... Fox, get this guy off me! Eric! 
Take her somewhere else on a date. Oh. Sorry, I got the timeline. You've been here like four fucking times. Take her out to dinner. Go see a play. I mean, maybe in his mind, he's like, he found her here and she can't talk, so he's trying to, like, get her memories back or whatever. Or maybe he's lost in a desert island and this is Survivor. Couldn't she write him messages? She can sign her name. She did sign that contract. That's a good point. She can write at least her own name. Uh, uh. <laughs> why did you... This isn't porn star. Yeah, I was going to say, like, why did you have to cover his eyes? I mean, that's more scandalous. <laughs> that's true. They're okay. Man, they were so close. Oh, they're more than okay. Well, I think we ought to get back to looking for Ursula. Yeah, good idea. Good. That is All a good idea. All do is search the ocean. That's so Bill <laughs> Farmer goofy, right? Yeah. Is it weird that I know Bill Farmer is the voice of Sam for Sam and Max the most? Yeah, she's probably on oh. <laughs> uh, I'm an old school LucasArts adventure fan. Oh, ah, yeah. <laughs> they made the best ones, and I think... Was... At least I think so. I can't hear anything. Oh, snap, you cheating bastard! What would I do to see like, dude, this is like getting some, getting some like, <laughs> catfish shit here. I like their camo mode. Yeah, she, he's hypnotized at this point. <laughs> yeah, Ursula is uh, macking on her man. Okay, Why? Is that in the original movie? That's pretty <laughs> Boom! Laser. And that happens in the movie too. <laughs> oh, cool. Well, that abruptly changed the plot of this film. Oh my gosh, that's how they do this? <gasps> Sora ex machina over there. <sighs> what? What happened? Mary Jane. Zit, zit. Well, face it, Tiger. You just hit the jackpot. <laughs> But they let Gwen Stacy die, is the question. You can talk. You're the one. The girl who sang to me. That reminds me, is it wrong if I Then I decided not to talk for five days while we dated. Do you love me now? Yeah. Uh, is it wrong if I still like Sam Raimi's Spider-Man films? Mm. That's fine. So I read two holds up. Yeah. Ariel. Oh, I I'm even kind of like it. Out Get out of my house! Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've never watched it all the way through. I've only I, seen the memes. I never watched it for the longest time, and then when I watched uh, it, I went in with low expectations. And it ended up being more brutal than I thought it That's awesome looking. <laughs> oh, she's gonna just fucking drown her. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, she turned into a mermaid because the sun set. Because the time ran out on the uh, magic, I think. It's part of the contract. Well, they broke, broke it, maybe? I don't know. Well, Sora didn't sign the contract. precious little daughter signed a contract. Yeah, here it is. They're bringing it up. Now, dearie, let's see how beautiful you are when... A contract by, like... You. Oh, Sir, which law? Bad touch. Bad oh, touch. Yes. <laughs> I've seen a lot of that on Google. Right in the contract! <laughs> oh, now, even the great King Triton can't go around breaking binding cards. Who are the lawyers yeah, down saying. here? Like, under whose authority? He's uh, King Triton! You'll excuse me. I I'm just wondering what sort of paper that is made out of. Also, Ariel is a uh, minor. Also true. Ooh. So, it was. Ugh. So she would need um, uh, his permission to sign any contract. Unless the age of consent laws don't work in uh, ocean court. We'll have to figure out what's the um, what's the current word of the law. Can't you just sell legal this piece by throwing water balloons at each other? Damn. Dick, you're fired! He's a stamp instead of signing it himself. That's pretty nice. Yeah. I mean, he's the king. He would have a royal seal. Wow, 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 as a wow, laser. Wow, wow, wow. Ah. Oh, this is... stuff is happening. 
Oh, that's right. I remember that now. Yeah, they get turned into these weird, like, coral things. I don't know what the fuck these are supposed to be. At last! Daddy! Ha! Who's the mighty ruler of the seas now? now was this this is just like a Super Mario Brothers movie. <laughs> Andrew, we're losing his fucking mind. I, both of you had good. Well, you had the great reference, and then he hit me with the Koopa <laughs> to, to a chair. Yep. Sound bite uh, from a podcast hey, that we really like. No mo wo. Yeah. Shout out. Feeling nerds. They're still going, right? Yeah. I just, just caught like every other month or so. Gotcha. Pretty infrequent. Yeah, they're busy. I'm I summoning imagine the dragon underwater. When they come back, they'll have Musicals. Oh. a new version of Dragon Quest to talk about. The da 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 Dragon Quest. That uh, is that you? <laughs> 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 oh, oh, if this is. Oh. Yeah. Isn't this how Dragon Guard 3 ended? <laughs> Bizarre. Now, Dragon Guard 3 had aliens. You do pretty Gosh. well, Dustin. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Don't say poopsies. <laughs> this song is not good. Yeah. It reminds me of Steven Universe. And I like Steven Universe. Oh, crap. I hit the wrong button. Oh, Donald! Oh, Damn. we just fucking vaporized him. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, you're so much more powerful in song. What a feeble human. Wait, Jim. Damn it. Oh, no! But you basically won already. So is this like David Cage gravy from here on out? There we go. Man, she would have got fucking knocked off. This. Oh, this is still fucking happening. Oh, we're doing this again. <laughs> the poop I thought again. It. She was able to keep the song going while getting hit in the nose. I I. To drain her whole fucking Ursula meter. <laughs> so why am I still? Yeah. Stop saying poopsies. Stop. Stop calling her mommy. Yeah, that's true. All toasters toast poop. <laughs> Ursula, swing lower. <laughs> well. By the way, <laughs> who voices Ursula anyway? I no earthly idea. Because that voice sounds incredibly familiar, and I can't quite pinpoint it. It's mermaid kick! Oh! <laughs> it always works. <laughs> oh, God! Well... It's not possible. It's over, Ursula. What?! That belongs to me! All right, then. You can have it. Call me Ishmael! <laughs> Damn! Yeah. So anime nonsense! Oh, this is great! Actually pretty cool. <laughs> Whoa. I feel like there should be dramatic music right uh, now. Bubbles are really underwhelming for a PS2 game, but still. Those are some poopsy bubbles already. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Please, Ariel. You can come out now. It's okay. Ariel? <laughs> Whoosh. Uh huh. Goofy likes what he sees. Yeah, <laughs> I've also seen ET. What's your point, Ariel? <laughs> you see, Eric? This is why I went to Ursula. This He's. Look, he's literally a prince. To think. Eric, goodbye. I had all that time and I didn't work on my swimming. 
Such a dumb anime thing to do is yeah, like do a comment what? to yourself to make her turn around. Will you teach me? Oh, I'd love to. All right. <laughs> well, time to go home. Slowly descend into the water. There is abyss. Yeah. Oh yeah, I didn't even equip the last Keyblade either. Oh yeah. Well, you didn't need it. Yeah, not really. You're a great guy. But he is human. That, that's your Sebastian? No. I wasn't <laughs> trying very hard. I was gonna say... Oh, you didn't do a Sora voice. You didn't, you didn't yell at me for that. No, no, no. You, you went with, like, ease, and I thought you were trying to do Sebastian, nah. and I was super surprised. Well, I can try my Donald voice again. <laughs> what the <laughs> <is that? laughs> What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Let me try my goofy voice. Well, I can do a little better at goofy at least. <laughs> uh, hey, it's goofy time. <laughs> <laughs> it's goofy time, motherfucker. That's from the internet. No, Dad, no! <laughs> See, I picked up that reference. Uh, that's, that's an old, that's a classic meme right there. Alright. Uh, thing. Okay, it's talking. Cut my know. hair. Oh, but how? We was gonna make this. Oh, we gotta do another song. Okay. Well, we're gonna come back to this. Cause we need Thundagaga. Right. Need because Lady that's Gaga. safe to use underwater. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, that's just totally murder. That's well, I'm wow. gonna save real quick. So that way I don't have to do that shit again. Because that was weird. <laughs> Look, it's better than Swim This Way was, so I'll give it that. Swim the yeah, the first song you did? Is yeah. That Sw is the worst song I may have ever heard in my entire life. I don't know. <laughs> so it's not a parody of Born This Way. God, This game wish. existed before that. I wish. Well, it was performed this way, but we're out. Yeah. Yeah. I, I remember reading this on like Tumblr or something, and someone posted, "If Weird Al ever dies, God forbid, but when he when he ever uh, passes away, all the artists who he covered should do a tribute concert where they perform his version of their songs." Aww. That, you should do that while he's alive. Really awesome. That is the I want that to happen now. Yeah, like that you is the single like big throne. That's the single best idea I've ever heard in my life. And I want that. I want that to be reality. I want the world to be that pure. I hope you can get Coolio. No, I know they catch up. <laughs> also, why is Goofy a turtle again? <laughs> Does he just like turtles? Because he was a sea turtle and he's a land turtle. I don't. Say it again. Simba. One more time. Simba. <laughs> like Goofy's expression. They're just like. <laughs> okay, it's a funny name. Fucking get over it. Go on then. See for yourself. Simba is one wishy washy king. Yeah, I bet about now even some of those high and mighty lionesses were wishing they'd gotten themselves a different king. I so he's bad in bed? I'm actually enjoying this more than I thought I would. Despite voicing my opinions on Kingdom Hearts in the last episode. They're, they're not terrible games. They're really inconsistent. And they get frustrating with uh, Organization 13. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, shit. But wait, no. We better tell Simba about this. That's not Zeehan or posing as Scar, is it? <laughs> Probably. That is where he lives. <laughs> oh. Well, poo. Alright, let's... Right, let's oh my gosh. Alright! Bam! Yeah, 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 yeah! Oh, that's a good song, <laughs> Yeah, that's a good one, too. <laughs> so, Mike, what do you think of this? <laughs> <laughs> this is how we're gonna play this whole level. <laughs> I have no idea why they decided to program the game this way. I'm delighted that they did. Yeah, yeah. It's fantastic. Alright, let me check. Um, so that's not in Kingdom Hearts 3, I riot. The Fast and the Furious uh, Africa Drift. That's yes! Perfect. <laughs> perfect. We didn't come up with that. Ooh, that's I a good I cannot one. believe I did. Combo boost. And that's the worst movie in the series. Deal with it, people. 
I'm sorry. I don't have any strong opinions about the Fast and Furious movies. That's totally fair. It took me a while to get into it. Yeah. But I actually kind of like Too Fast, Too Furious, which is apparently you've ever seen. Hmm. That's all right. They all kind of blend together as far as I know. The first two haunt me, because, like, I went over to a friend's house, um, and it was a family that had five boys, and they were all super into the first two movies Hmm. at the time. They put it on a um, tape changer, so, like, it just looped and looped those two movies for a solid week of my life straight, without ever turning off the television, it was either the first Fast and Furious or Too Fast, Too Furious. And, like, they would, like, be either at work or whatever, they'd come home, and they'd watch a little bit of it, then go to their own bedroom or get something to eat, and then, like, catch a few minutes randomly of either movie. So, like, I'd either be playing on the computer or hanging out with one of them or doing stuff. Yeah. And it was just constantly in the background, either Fast and Furious 1 or 2. And I'm not joking for five straight days of my life. So, I, I'm still a little scarred by those movies. Oh, man. Let me tell you a story about that. So, I was, uh, when I was in college, the uh, first time I went to college up in uh, Pittsburgh, I had a roommate who couldn't sleep without the TV on. And I couldn't oh. sleep with the TV on. So the, our nightly ritual would be he'd put in a movie he'd seen before, fall asleep, and because I can't stop a movie halfway through because I'm freaking neurotic, I would wait for the movie to end, turn off his Xbox, go to bed myself, in the peace and quiet, after he was already asleep. So I saw Step Brothers 60 fucking times. i never seen it once all the way through. And I saw Grandma's Boy 80 fucking times. <laughs> Charles, watch Grandma's Boy. We talked about this. Well... It's not great, but you'll like it. It's, it's fun. It's very silly. But that reminds me of when I was with Brynn, who would watch the same movie every night. And it started with, like, the um, Lord of the Rings movies, and I kind of got those drilled into my mind. Mm -hmm. uh, but what was worse is after a while, it became the Lord of the Rings commentary. So sometimes when I would see scenes or, like, the movie, you know, playing regular, in my mind, I'm like... Oh, yeah, we used to mess with Elijah all the time, you know, in the makeup room. We would get in there early, like two hours early, and we would take the stuff. But I can remember some of the stories from the commentary <laughs> about them talking about getting all the perfect sheets and such. Oh. It became really bizarre when I could quote the commentary. That Chronicles of Riddick was um, one of her favorites. That was a fun movie. I've seen it a trillion times through falling asleep so, so I used to have that movie like memorized your life story is that you can't escape Vin Diesel oh my god <laughs> there's a connection here I, I, I'm gonna find it somehow <laughs> whatever it is and put Vin Diesel in Lord of the Rings put it in Kingdom Hearts <laughs> yeah. they put Groot in here now right they could <laughs> And they haven't done any Marvel properties yet. Yeah, that would probably be a huge... Uh, well, they made some recent purchases. Put the Iron Giant in here. I'm I'm yes. sorry. I've learned the what? <laughs> sorry, I just got a new ability. Let me let me, let me me see that shit. The running tackle. Okay. Oh, that's cool. How's it work? <gasps> Holy just shit. We can drift, drift all and over. spin. Yeah. Huh. Dustin, this. you don't have to stop drifting ever. <laughs> yeah. Dun, dun, Don't play Mario Kart DS up in here. And make a supersonic line out of you. <laughs> I know you do, buddy. Uh, so, is there anything up here? You know what? We've had enough legitimate material to abort our Simpsons commentary. <laughs> you know, when you uh, decide not to do something on a show, you should bring it up on the show. <laughs> Oops. Uh, edit in the sick evil. No, that's fine. I, I, I'd rather uh, make fun of you than edit it out. <laughs> no, no, no. It's fine. We can, we can still. Like, we've got a little bit of pride rock left, so go ahead and talk Simpsons, guys. All right, we're going to I actually Simpsons. decided. I thought about talking this. Simpsons. Why don't we just start where we left off? It, it's okay. Oh, All it's right. Season three. What we were doing, I, I just wanted to like, describe the huge nerd thing going on. Yeah. I, when I picked them up, he pulled out Wikipedia and was going Simpsons episode by episode because him and his friends were rewatching it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. And um, 
he was asking me my thoughts on him, and we were like debating back and forth grades slash like what's the best episode up to this point. Where are we at? You can play along. We just did Homer at the Bat. Homer at the Bat, which we agreed up to that point is the best Simpsons <laughs> episode. It's the softball episode. We're talking softball. Yeah, you Here to me? San Diego. Softball. Madeline Lee and Canseco. It's <laughs> Ken Griffey with his grotesquely swollen jaw. Steve Saxon is running with the law. I'm talking Homer. Ozzy and the Straw. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> cool. Uh, all right, what we got next? Up next we, we, is okay. separate vocations. Separate vocations. Can you jog my mind on this one? That is the one where Bart, after uh, going with the police at some point on his mm. job, I, I, I forget why in the first place, but he decides cool to become a hall monitor, and then Lisa, disturbed by her possible future, becomes a delinquent. Oh, yeah. That's a solid one. Because... Okay. Piss off, ghost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nicely done. <laughs> yeah. Whee! Uh, I'm part. giving that a good one. I, I'll give it a good. Yep. By our criteria. Ah, uh, is pretty solid. Now, I, I like ones where Bart and Lisa are definite brothers and sisters. Yeah, we, we talked about this before. We really like when the Simpsons' children get to be children. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Instead it's of, a, like, joke... Receptacles. Yeah, whatever exactly. caricatures they became down the line. Yeah. I'll say it right now. I think, I think Lisa the Vegetarian kind of really is. That's not a terrible opinion. Okay. Because, like, I don't think it ruined her, but it definitely, like, let future episodes. Yeah, it opened the door. Yes, yes. yes. Certainly. To they, abuse that side of her. Yeah, they leaned into it a lot more. They leaned into a angry, let me, like, nag at you, Lisa. Yeah. The, so the qu so. answer to the question no one asked. Oh. Oh. See, I can keep up. Oh. Oh. I've well, seen a Simpson. you got to the bottom, too, was a case of Malamar! <laughs> <laughs> Although I love that rant, that episode also kind of ruined really the mm. I'm throwing out the hot takes. Yeah, yeah, you plays it already. We're going way too far ahead. Dog of Death. You say you confused the Santa's little helpers. I did. But this is the one with the lottery fever. And then okay. the Simpsons lose. And then he knows that Santa's little helper and he's in operation. Mm. And because of the money it costs them, they hate him. So then he drifts and then he becomes one of the Mr. Burns' hounds. Yeah. I, I, these episodes are like almost Rugrats episodes. Uh, I, I, dog person? Oh, well, classy shoe folk. I am a dog. I, all right. I like dogs. I don't worship them. I don't see. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Rant time. Like E3 again. Um. Uh. John Berthanol. The Burns. Yeah. He brought out his dog. He told the dog to yeah. sit. Dog sat quietly. I was seeing fan art of the dog, like, with a huge smile. I was seeing fan art no, of the dog, No, the dog sat there and did nothing. I was seeing fan art of, like, the dog being the greatest thing at E3. People were taking that in the count of Reeves, like, you're breathtaking to the dog. The dog was great! He came out there, he did what he was told, and he was chill. But, like, when people see a dog, they're like, Oh my god, doggo, life is so good. Pet the doggo. And they just freak the fuck out. That I'm not that person. <laughs> I'm a person who's like, dogs are awesome pets. No. The crucial question is, was that, was that dog cuter than a cutie method? The answer is no. 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 <laughs> yeah, that was that was fun. Like, it just became it instant. Doesn't. Yeah. Roll clip. Um, doing editing all night. And then I'll sleep until noon. <laughs> Dustin, that's a nice song you got there. Yeah, how's it going, man? Oh, Dustin, you got that link I sent you. Yeah, yeah, of uh, Ikuma Nakamura from... Uh, oh, from all Nintendo. that fan art was so cute. Yeah, it was great. People really love her. Oh, man, um, she's so adorable. I just want to go up on stage and, like, give her a hug. Yeah, I want to respect her boundaries. Dustin, what do you want? In a word, chaos. I really like that gag where he, he said, I respect her boundaries. Yeah. That's the clip. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, cool. It's okay. He just showed it, I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll throw it in there. Uh, okay. Uh, so I'm going to give that one a eh. Fair enough. Uh, Colonel Homer. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, gosh. Colonel That's Homer. 
That's a pretty dramatic. I finally one. bagged I like myself a home. Oh, that's the one, yeah. Oh. I'm gonna have to cut you off for hearing a grinding sound. And then Marge is just like, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck is that last hyena? Oh gosh, I love that episode. I love that it's episode really for Homer. Yes. Um, it's a great showing of Homer's character. Beverly D'Angelo is a great guest star. Yeah, Laura Lee. It's um uh. Ah, there you uh, go. I, I I love the fake uh. Yahoo show or whatever they got. Oh gosh. Yeah, I, I, it's not. In, it, I was gonna say, is this like the best one so far? I'm gonna say no, but so, like, I it's at least that more, worth it's a really good having movie. the conversation because that's a really good. Idea. Ah, why did you double back? Wildcat him. Wow, Simba <laughs> this is ridiculous. Do you even need to fight with Simba in your party? And like, yes, I do. I do have shouting to... about Colonel Homer. There. That was a terrible sound. That was some Mikolash bullshit there. Yeah, I, I just, <laughs> I just decided it's like no, no, no. Guess you caught us all. Oh, next up is Black Widow, the second episode of Sancho Bob, where he marries Selma for his for a month. Ah, uh, it's all right. It's like all right to good, right? It's not Kate Fury. No, <laughs> not even close. <laughs> but I, I like Bart like figuring it out. My personal favorite bit is tonight. Kaifer. 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 I don't know why, just echoing in Bart's head. That's, that's just... they, they, I don't uh, know how Big Kaifer became a running gag on the show. Uh, what? Man, he's saying a lot for his mouth not moving. It's a Japanese dub, they'll do that. Son of a great Mufasa. I think this isn't Jerry. <laughs> I was about to say, any closer, Jeremy's you're just iron. gonna shove your butthole right in uh, uh, Kenzie's face. <laughs> oh, uh, next up is the auto show. All right, so this is auto moves in with the Simpsons. Yep, and also the one with the Spinal Tap. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You shit. <laughs> oh, I brought my charger. Do you think um, we can help? You're not even using your phone right now. No, I just decided to bring up Sacred Rumble. <laughs> All right, now time to go back out to where we were. So we went out here for a pointless interlude. Now to go back for another pointless interlude. You're gonna talk to Nala and Rick. Okay. <laughs> is blue. Hey, look there they are. Or Simba. And then you're gonna go to Oasis to find Simba. So there you go. Next. Yeah. Oh, uh, the oh yeah, the auto fine. show. It's fine, right? Go to all yeah, three of it, the places. I Could think that's better. the only episode Otto ever got, so I like uh, that basis. I mean, I'm sure in the up to 30 seasons he's had more, but I guess he's in the pot episode. But we're going late yep. Simpsons yeah. by then. Yeah, at least. Uh, Bart's friend falls in love. It's one of Samantha Stanky. That was all right. All right. I give it bonus points because I'm a huge Twin Peaks geek, and uh, Kimmy Robertson, who was Lucy in that show, voiced Samantha. Mm. So, and she's pretty adorable. I yeah, guess. yeah, yeah. And Bart's kind of a jerk in this one. Of course. But, uh, I can't think of much else to say about it's it. Kind it's kind of a just a good life lesson. I actually kind of think thing. I like the B plot a little more, where the B -plot. Homer uh, gets the vocabulary tapes instead of the weight loss tapes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And then he just likes the gourmand that falls into the voluptuary. Homer, <laughs> what in God's name are you? Yes. Um, it's getting weight, but his vocabulary gets better. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, that one's for you. Uh, and brother. Why am I fighting Scar's ghost? That's Sim like that's Simba's like demon, inner demons. I still can't get over watching Goofy spin. Uh, brother, can you spare? Her? Two times. Yes, brother. Uh, that's, that's... I mean, her pal all the way, but yes. Uh, this one, such a weird idea. The baby speak translator thing. It is. I it's wonder... like, like almost a little too far for even a Simpsons plot at this point. But it it's is a, a strong little... episode. But I am glad they brought her back. I am glad that they tied that up and actually made something good out of it after the prior episode. While a great one was a very depressing ending. Yeah. And uh, there's some pretty good uh, gags here and there, like Professor Frank uh, somehow has his son on a plane, which then crashes outside the expo, and he says, Oh god, my wife is going to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> but no, yeah, that's a pretty Frank solid Frank really destroy me. Can you give me the uh, one from Flaming Moe's? You did it pretty well earlier. Oh yeah. <clears throat> 
secret ingredient is love? Who's been screwing with this thing? <laughs> <laughs> I do not do a bad hunk of area, apparently. No, that's, that's, that's a good one. Um, but yeah, that's the end of Season 3. Homeward the Bat, best one. Yeah, that's our best one so far. Yes, it is. Of Season 1, 2, or 3. Yeah. <laughs> it's just dripping away. Oh my god, this is a blur of colors. Oh yeah. A blur, you say? Put in song two if you don't get sued by it. <laughs> okay, that song's gonna play. Do like three seconds of it, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> my dad's parrot loves that song. Does he just go? He'll dance. He'll bop back and forth. He'll do okay, this like little head right. weave thing. <laughs> I've tried other music. It doesn't work as well. He likes that song. So he's a parrot. So he's a tropical bird. So does he like Bumble in the Jungle? <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> also, Dustin. Yeah. I got it. Sorry about that. That's okay. I, I get I get into playing the game. Ah, right, we're doing a lot. <laughs> yep. Yep. I'm it's... finding this more interesting as we're going along. Though. Yeah. I should probably look into this. I'm stuff. sad because I saw a ghost. Like, what, what, what are we getting out of this? Uh, the scene? ghost is making fun of him. It's telling him that he's a bad king and that he's he's not ready and all this I got thing. That. It's, it's... Balls yeah, up, Simba. Go. He doesn't exist. He's I know. Dead. For God's sake, it's, he's wuss. It's, it's, it's the metaphorical ghost of Scar becoming a literal ghost of Scar. Well, then. Isn't that super? <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, it's still kind of silly, but it, it does thematically make sense for Simba. I gotcha. Like, I, 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 like the Pride Lands one. I think is probably one of the better stories in this game. That's fair. Plus, drifting around as a lion is really it's a fucking fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know if this is my favorite like level because it's very. It's simple. kind of open and bland at times, but yeah. Actually, let me ask this now. Yeah. What Kingdom Hearts games are the ones most worth playing? One, two, three. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was the answer. I thought you just. I no. I, so many Kingdom Hearts fans will be like, you know, you gotta play with Aqua. You gotta get Birth by Sleep. Yeah, you know, that's, that's the best one. Birth by Sleep is good. Thirty-five, eight over. You two can days you can skip that one. Kingdom Hearts okay, a proper gotcha. fraction. You can totally skip. Um, Chain of Memories. You can skip. Mm. It's a BS one, but it's kind of fun. Yeah, gotcha. it's just not necessary to play. Um, I recommend cool card watching uh, Barry Kramer's "A Good Enough Summary of Kingdom Hearts." Gotcha. <laughs> that might be the way to go, and then play three. Yeah. That's not what you're supposed to be. You can't be Mufasa. You can only be you. Everybody yeah. believes in you as a king. They just want to see what I don't. You do. <laughs> I almost maybe spit my soul. Because you haven't much yet. That's all. I know that. Yeah, we all believe in you because you haven't accomplished anything. Believe in the Simba that believes in you. God damn it. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. What a loser. Oh, well, you guys gave up. Good <laughs> goofy, just forlorn. I do what I'm told. <laughs> Okay, why are you there? He's friends. Do nothing, King. No! Try and stop me. Um. They were you did making Scar go. What? Yeah. You found the Vingus! It was within you all along! Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Maybe the real ghost was the friends we made along the way. <laughs> oh, Clam Clark. Oh, yeah, Sam Clark. Yeah. Yep. Yes, he has. We went we a whole episode on his entire filmography. Yes. That's awesome. The, if you want to watch the Cam Clark Hour. Did you get Did you get Andre Olmeda from Killer Seven? I don't think we went through Killer Seven. Darn. That's the great logo back. <laughs> I am a real nerd for episode that two. Game personally, but uh, it is a weird ass game. <laughs> episode two. You guys remember Killer Seven? <laughs> I did play it before. It's fun. And really weird. Oh, yeah. Simba! 
What do you expect? It's like, I love that, I love No More Heroes, and then it feels like Suda 51 hasn't quite matched those two. Since then, I'm sad. Okay, actually, I got to let it die for a while. But... Yeah, it was alright. I played a little bit of it, too. Cool. Dustin played a bit more than I did. I actually beat floor 40. Wow! I admit to spending some stuff for doing that. Yeah, that, I mean... The game kind of forced it. Shit, like... I, I was so heavily into it, I could just walk away at that point. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, but the final boss is a cheat. Well, you're about to fight a thing. Oh, boy. We're here. Where's Simba? Fucking stro- uh, Oh, my God. I'm a boss. <laughs> Uh, I've come back, Nala. All right. Piss off, ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, let me ask this for you guys. Best MCU movie. Uh, well, you kind of know my answer because I've been doing the rankings, but my favorite's still Guardians of the Galaxy one. Uh, best is a different kind of answer, but like I, I don't know, I really like Civil War. Yeah, my favorite Civil War personally. Yeah. That's um, I'll see. I I'm, I'm torn between the like, Guardians one and Civil War are probably my two favorites. So I'm go. torn between We're those kind two. We're on the same page here. The best there. That was easy. But then again, there is no wrong answer as long as you don't say Thor the Dork World. Don't correct me, Dork World. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I wrote it when I did my rankings, and even on our like movie night list back dark in the day. Shit. The dark <laughs> shit. <laughs> Every time. Oh, it's... Oh, wait till you see what it is. Yeah. What the fuck is that? Yeah. Oh, okay. Donald and Goofy fucked off, I guess. <laughs> oh, oh, well. Boy. Oh. You need them to spin it away! Yeah. <laughs> You're just gonna drift around and whack his ankles. I mean... He's so big. Oh, God. Oh, Oh boy, he's way bigger than I expected. Okay, this seems like bullshit all of a sudden. Oh, it is. <laughs> all right, Mike, season four of The Simpsons. Let's go. Oops, there's a red light here. Is that That's bad? okay. No, it's just my phone is charging. Oops. It's okay. There you go, buddy. Okay, Camp Krusty. You don't like this one. I was talking to you, Mike. Yeah. Wait, I don't. I was just asking. I had a feeling, but am I wrong? I like this one. He's like offended. <laughs> Jump on it. <laughs> it's like, what? No, no, it is a really good one. Um, not very How do I get that? Uh, it's, uh... I'm, I'm it sorry, a what? a cruel episode, but, you know, I really do like how it ends, how Bart builds up to Lord of the Flies, the camp. Yeah. And then there's even the pig's head thrown in there for good reference. Um... That's ball. Yep. Gentlemen? <laughs> I had to do it once. I mean, <laughs> oh, gentlemen's the evil. <laughs> I love that one. Yeah. Um, <sighs> I so am Crunchy the Clown. <laughs> the <laughs> fuck is this thing? It is the ground shaker. Well, it certainly is shaking me around a lot. Alright, what, what, what do you got? I'm gonna give that one a good one. Yeah, me too. We're good. The happiest place on earth! Tijuana! <laughs> I mean, you did try to do it. Well, <laughs> you people are pigs. I will personally spit on every 50th burger. I like those odds. <laughs> we have, we're not at the episode yet. Where did he go? Oh, he's over there. Um, how the f... Oh, I'm not even gonna ask. But yeah, my favorite gag from that episode is... Please don't be the boy. Please don't be the boy. <laughs> no! And then he suddenly loses his hair and gets his weed back. I mean, yeah. it's sad, but it's very hilarious. Uh, yep. next up... But yeah, it's a great episode. Uh, mm. Streetcar Named Marge. It's a good one. New Orleans. Oh, of Pirates and Trunks and Force in Orleans. <laughs> and I forget the next lyric there, but if you want to go to hell, you should take a trip to the Sodom and Gomorrah of the Mississippi. New Orleans. <laughs> yeah, the musical itself is hilarious. John Lovett says the jerk ass director of New Orleans is hilarious. Yeah. Uh, wow, is I jumped and it still hit me. fire. Oh, Flanders, we learned a lot about Flanders in this episode. He went to an all-male school and he played Flanch. <laughs> this is like the first time where, like, Flanders takes off his shirt and he's secretly jacked for no reason, <laughs> yes, right? exactly. Yeah. Yes. Yep. It started that weird idea of... <laughs> that did kind of, yeah, I, that is kind of weird. Pharmaceutical of steroids, I'm just saying. It's got connections. Wow. <laughs> PEDs. Wow. I never considered that. There's, I mean, he's never working out, but he's really jacked. I'm just yeah. saying, it's kind yeah. of something. Yep. 
But yeah, Homer is kind That's of a jerk. That's the power of Christ. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's very compelling. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I just say it, Dustin. Show a picture of stupid, sexy Flanders. I mean, just <laughs> that shirt on—it's ridiculous. All right, uh, that's a good episode. But yeah. Jeez, things uh, are happening. Really one, yes. Yeah, dumbass uh, Homer in that one. Yeah. Yep. Speaking of Homer the heretic, I love this one. That's the one where he skips church. And oh. Guy comes up with the fish and says, yeah, you know, he should support religion in his own way. Then his house sets on fire. Yeah. This, this is a good one. This one's filled with a lot of great gags. I love the ducks crossing. What the do I do? He says, <laughs> you ducks are trying my patience. You're so cute. <laughs> it's that is an adorable joke. And ah, then damn it. when Flanders tosses Homer under the mattress below, and then he just bounces back into the house. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah. That's a good fight. Gag. And, yeah. one, and one more. You know, every religion, uh, every religion's been helping you, Homer, be they Christian, Jew, or Salamis. <laughs> <laughs> there are over 700 billion of us. Oh, that's super. <laughs> <laughs> Very condescending response from I'm you. sorry, what the fuck? I'm sorry, what the fuck? <laughs> Actually, real quick, Dustin. Yeah. You sent me a text this week from the uh, Washington Post, uh... Headline. Yeah. Can you tell me that and put the picture out? Yeah, it was um, talking about Bernie Sanders. It was like, more people would rather vote for an atheist or a Muslim than a socialist. <laughs> and I'm just sitting here going, one, one of, of these, these things, things is, is not like, like the other. other. <laughs> one of these things. <laughs> Sensationalism. I, I actually said the joke, like, time for everyone's favorite game show. <laughs> atheist, Muslim, or socialist. <laughs> And I really liked your, like, like little playthrough of it. Can oh, you... you did, like, the follow-up? I, I got that. Yeah, yeah. Please uh, please read that. I said that to Rachel. She just let me, like, a bunch of crying and laughing. Um... That was really fucking funny. Simba seems fine now. So we were joking about, again, something up with the America's favorite, or the South's favorite game show. Yeah. So I was just like, host, uh, so tell me, Congressman Regina Tlaib. Uh, is a atheist, Muslim, or socialist? Buzz, buzz, buzz. Yes, Dwight? Dwight, I'm gonna say she's an Obama. Hmm. <laughs> Judges? Ah, yes, the person is all of them, so we can accept Obama as an answer. Dwight gets another 12 cartons of Marlboros. <laughs> Where did you come up with that? I just came up with that as I was leaving work. <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable. It was pretty it was pretty fucking good. I was I, I was, was very inspired by the Washington Post bullshit like, atheist. You, you see puzzle. you see why I sent that to you. It's just like like that dumb fucking tagline. <laughs> I didn't mean to get all political loco on you, Mike. Hey, that's okay. Eh, well you didn't bring up the T word, so I'll accept it. Huh. <sighs> Thinks this, doesn't it? That's fine. Uh, we'll see. Twat. Twat. <laughs> That's a pretty nasty thing. Yeah. Tornado? Uh, Topeka? Trombone. Topiary. <laughs> Tapioca. Tungsten. Taskmaster. Tits. <laughs> Tats. Tots? <laughs> Things? This is becoming a King Crimson song. Toads. Toads. <laughs> Toads. Uh, Tango. Those. Tangerine. Oh. Cool. Well, <laughs> that ends our Pride Lands. Yeah. Uh, thank you for uh, joining us once again, Mike. <laughs> this will call that episode to a close. Oh, well, Merciful. Fun, <laughs> random, nonsense, magical journey we were on, Tim. This went yeah. all over the goddamn Oh, yeah. It is. That's, and that's how that's, we like it. That's half the fun, man. <laughs> that's what it is. Yep. All right. Uh, Thank you very much. Grab me. Thank you all. And okay, fine. It's Trump. <laughs> <laughs>